One of the more intriguing matchups outside of the New Year's Six, outside of the quote unquote marquee bowl games for me is the Music City Bowl. When you have Nebraska and the questionable status of Tommy Armstrong against a Tennessee team that was one of the most enigmatic teams oh. in the entire country, I mean, is it Tommy that we should be focused on or is there somebody else? It's got to be Tommy. Listen, Tommy is one of those players, over 10,000 uh, yards of total offense. This guy is one of those guys that when he leaves the program, I think people look back, kind of like I always said about Denard Robinson, and will have a greater appreciation when he's away from the game. But I also think because of the way he's finished, uh, Big Ten play, this is an opportunity, if he's healthy, to really go out on a high note and for really to salute the team, salute the university, where he's been able to have a great deal of success. But it's all got to start with Tommy. He's got to take care of the football. He's got to be able to run the football. And the defense has to be able to step up and slow his team down as well. And again, for Nebraska, after a very rough finish to the season, it kind of went off the rails quickly for Mike Riley and company. How did they finish? Because you can say all you want about Tennessee, but they have a ton of talent. No question. They are loaded at the talent position all over the place. They've got guys that can make plays. And if you know they're not ready to go, Nebraska, they could have some serious problems.